Hi, I'm Steve Bloom, CEO of the Portland Japanese Garden, and I want to thank you for the opportunity to co-host this wonderful winter concert by Oregon Kotokai. It's times like these that we realize just how important these partnerships are that we have out in the community with our fellow Japanese organizations uh, and that are bringing to our community uh, the heart and the spirit and the soul of Japan. Um, we need more of that now than ever before. So from all of us here at the Portland Japanese Garden, thank you for joining. I hope you enjoy the concert, um, and we'll look forward to seeing you here at the Garden in the new year. Happy holidays. We hope you enjoyed the first piece of Oregon Kotokai's fourth annual winter concert. For those of you new to Koto, it is a traditional Japanese instrument with 13 strings. Oregon Kotokai is a group largely based in Portland, Oregon. 
We put on performances throughout the year, both in traditional and modern styles. The winter concert is a time to enjoy Koto, performing songs that evoke images of snow, ice, family, and inspire warm feelings of gratitude in us all. This year, more than ever, we are grateful for community and for the many talents of those around us. For the past two years, Portland Japanese Garden has generously provided a performance space for this event. This year, we maintain our connection through the virtual world. You may have recognized favorite spots in the garden during our previous piece, and you can look forward to seeing pictures of our past performances at the garden later in the program. We are grateful for our continued partnership with Portland Japanese Garden and look forward to the future when we can resume cultural demonstrations once more. Although a virtual concert is no replacement for a live performance, it has inspired creativity in the ways we connect with those around us, especially in how we collaborate with other artists in Portland. This year, we are honored to include original poetry by two members of Oregon Haiku Kai, Nana Goto Belarude and Mina Roy. Mina Roy was born and raised in Japan. She came to this country to study wildlife biology. She has lived in Montana and Alaska and in Oregon for over 10 years. She loves nature and wildlife, and she loves to put her thoughts into haiku. She has been an active member of Oregon Haiku Kai since 2016. Nana Goto Belarude enjoys putting Oregon seasons and her daily life into haiku. She finds similarities between haiku and ikebana, Japanese floral art, that she also enjoys daily. Starting with many ideas, emotions, and feelings, Nana pairs them down to a 575 syllable pattern to capture the essence of the moment. She's been an active member of Oregon Haiku Kai since 2017. As some of you may already know, haiku is a type of short form poetry originally from Japan. Traditional Japanese haiku comprises three lines with a 575 syllable pattern and a kigo or seasonal word. However, modern haiku may not strictly follow these traditional elements. The following music has been carefully selected and curated by our founder and artistic director, Mitsuki Dezai. Some of the songs have been edited in length to match the mood and style of our program today. Before each piece, you'll have the pleasure of hearing an original haiku, both in English and Japanese, and we hope it inspires your imagination as you listen to the music. Above all, today's concert is a celebration of the season and our community. We hope you continue to enjoy Oregon Kotokai's first ever virtual winter concert. Mizutori mo amo poketto ni te o irete. Mizutori mo amo poketto ni te o irete. On the cold winter day, waterfall float with the wings stuck tight. I circle the pond, hands stuffed in pocket.
膝の絵の午後の日差しやケイトアム。膝の絵の午後の日差しやケイトアム。ニッティングオンザウィンターデイ。アフタヌーンサンマイラブ、メイクスミフィールウォーマ。わびすけや酒けどたずぬる人のなしわびすけや酒けどたずぬる人のなしわびすけカミリアザブルーミング but nobody sees them
餌まきし子によるかもの早さかな餌まきし子によるかもの早さかな I often walk around this pond and see people feed birds, all kinds of birds, geese, ducks, and the children like to feed them, and when they do, ducks come towards them really fast. And that is the scene that this haiku is about. ウスベニのかすかにエムや冬装備。ウスベニのかすかにエムや冬装備。Roses in summertime are energetic and beautiful. Winter roses are a little bit shy and quiet.
Thank you again for joining us today, and we hope you've enjoyed the program so far. We have one final piece to share with you called Merry Christmas, Mr. Lawrence, which was written by the prolific Japanese composer Ryuichi Sakamoto as part of a soundtrack for a movie by the same name. The movie stars David Bowie as a prisoner of war, and while not exactly a heartwarming Christmas tale, the score is hauntingly beautiful, and the title track has become one of Sakamoto's most celebrated works. This Kodo version was arranged by our teacher and artistic director, Mitsuki Desai, and was first performed at our 2018 holiday concert at the Portland Japanese Garden. Since that time, it's become a staple of our holiday concert programs, and we can't wait to perform it again live for all of you. Until that time, please enjoy our virtual version of Merry Christmas, Mr. Lawrence.